Across America this morning, investigators say they've found the body of a missing boy who caught national headlines 27 years ago. Jacob Wetterlein was just 11 years old when he was kidnapped in 1989. The case changed the community and the nation. Ellery McCardle reports. For decades, the Wetterling home has projected a feeling of hope. The family's porch light is still on, a sign for Jacob to come home. Now neighbors are sending their own messages of hope to the family, a hope that they'll stay strong as they've learned Jacob's remains were found and he won't be coming back. I mean, I've heard about him my whole life and just finally hearing that he, he's found is... I just don't know what to say. Throughout the day, neighbors and strangers have stopped by to lay flowers, letters, and their own signs of faith. The community's bond with the Wetterlings is even more great, but at the same time stirring up memories of Jacob's disappearance 26 years ago. I found out I was pregnant that year that Jacob was kidnapped. I had children about that same age. When I come home from work, I made sure they were home. Call it a memorial or just a sign of compassion. The community of St. Joseph hopes and prays for peace for the Wetterlings and those still waiting for missing loved ones to come home. I hope they find happiness. Well, Jacob's abduction led to the federal law that requires states to maintain sex offender registries. Investigators are not saying yet if anyone has been charged, but multiple reports claim a suspect in the case led the FBI to the remains. However, there was no word on who that suspect is.